ready. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Priscilla, and I am here today with another Let's go row, 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 row. What is a scroller box? You might be asking. Scroller box is a monthly art subscription box that is sent straight to your mailbox or your PO box or your front step every single month. This little thing is full of art supplies. I can't wait. Can you wait? So let's go ahead and open it. This is what it looks like when you open it up inside. It got some nice pretty lilac paper. Candy. <gasps> So what Sketchbox sends me is this really cool art print of this girl. I don't know who it is, <laughs> but I can learn all about the artist on the back of here. So I can learn a little bit more about him and how to look up his art and everything. Oh, he's on Twitch TV. How fun. What Scrawlerbox has also sent me is a little bookmark. Now this bookmark tells me about all the, ow, 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 that hurt. Stop it. I stabbed myself in the eye. Oh my gosh, that hurt. That really hurt. <laughs> Scholar Box sent me this bookmark and it tells me all about these fantastic, wonderful art supplies that is included in this box. So I get to learn all about these art supplies. These are kind of cool. They're highlighters. <gasps> Woo! These are so cool. Wait a second. Oh my gosh, guys. My childhood is being revisited. This they smell! They're smelly highlighters! Oh, I love this one. <gasps> I get Statler's fine liners. So I've got like, there's a 03 millimeter. There's a 0 0.45. Never seen one of those before. But it kind of looks like it might just be a regular pen. Oh! <gasps> I've got a nice little highlighter one. I've got this one. I think I just broke it. Okay, cool. Oh, it's a mechanical pencil. Oh my gosh, this is like the pack, the go-to pack, the little travel pack. I got a nice ballpoint pen and I've got a nice fine liner. Ooh, I like this because it's shiny. And I've got three Koi Noor highlighter pencils. Ooh, so they're super duper bright. So I've got a nice, Highlighter yellow, highlighter orange, and a nice bright green. Look how pretty those colors are! Fine marker. Mmm, I like it. They sent me this really nice Sylvine sketchbook. Now it's A5, size A5. That's a nice, like, travel around sketchbook. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to use this. I can't believe they sent me a sketchbook. But this is the coolest part about Scroller Box is they send you candy! Hmm. My favorite thing about Scrawler Box is what they have on the back of your bookmark called the Scrawler Challenge. Now what the Scrawler Challenge is, they give you a prompt on the back of your bookmark and what you have to do is take all of these supplies that Scrawler Box has sent to you in this month's box and use those supplies to make a beautiful creation out of this month's prompt. And this month's prompt is Workspace highlight. Ooh. Let's go ahead and jump into a time lapse and let's make something awesome. Let's so let's take a look at these fantastic art supplies that Scrawler Box has sent to us in this month's box. So I was thinking about how could I interpret workspace highlights. Uh, some workspaces have fish in them. I know definitely my orthodontist has aquariums everywhere. Um, some dentist office have aquariums. Uh, look at Finding Nemo. <laughs> but some workspaces also have betta fish. Now betta fish are pretty cool. They're pretty low key fish. They don't really have to take you do have to take care of them, but they're not high maintenance like saltwater fish or anything like that. But I thought it would be cool that maybe if I were to have like a cubicle or a desk, I would have a betta fish in my office. So maybe that'd be the highlight of my workspace. <laughs> and so that's what I thought. <laughs> but these Ko I Noor highlighter pencils lived up to their name. Look how pretty those leaves are. They were gorgeous to work with. I also used them on the rocks. They literally are amazing to work with. And these highlighters, the M Lighter fluorescent pens, not only were they fantastic to smell while working with them, but they gave me a chance to make my betta fish into a galaxy betta fish. Now I used my Stabilo 
point max marker to go ahead and line a few things but when it came to really fine lining stuff i jumped into my stadler little box of awesome pins and pencils and i went ahead and i started using that fine liner to get into the smaller spaces like the fish's fins or his scales so but the uh stabilo point max pens that was really nice to line everything with so I feel like this was two challenges in one for this month's box, for Scrawler box, because not only did we do the Scrawler challenge for workspace highlight, but we also did the highlighter challenge. So two challenges in one. Whoever got this box, we did two challenges together. <laughs> but it's, it's awesome because the highlighter challenge is to only color using highlighters. And I've already done that before. And now I did it all over again. I love Scrawler Box. No, I really do. I love that Scrawler Box not only sends me amazing, awesome art supplies that I probably have never tried before, but they actually challenge you as a creator. So they're giving you a prompt and they're telling you to go outside your comfort zone and not just draw the thing you've been drawing your whole life like superheroes or fantasy characters, but to draw something different. But yes, guys, if you want to get your own Scrawler Box and participate with me in the Scrawler Challenge, here's their website right here. I'm also going to put the link down below in the info box. Make sure you go and check it out so it's awesome they send amazing stuff and I always look forward to seeing scrawler box every month on my front doorstep but yes guys I hope you have a most wonderful day and I will see you all later bye